Welcome to Habit Tutorials. Again, I am Dion Pouncil, founder of Money School. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to scroll zoom and navigate your charts in NinjaTrader. It is already amazing, but when you know the ins and outs, it can be absolutely life changing. Let me show you some of the most basic commands here in this short tutorial. Scaling chart data can be accomplished easily by clicking and dragging in the axis of a chart. Doing this in the tied axis will scale the chart horizontally. This can also be accomplished by holding the control key and hitting the up and down arrows on the keyboard. Many traders will scale charts horizontally when they'd like to see more or less data in the chart window. Clicking and dragging in the price axis will scale the chart vertically and also place the chart into a fixed scale. Notice that there is a small F icon in the top right corner of the chart. When I click the F, I'm brought back into auto scaling. It's easy to scroll through charts horizontally using either the scroll bar at the bottom of the window or by simply clicking and dragging within the chart canvas. Additionally, you can use the scroll wheel on your mouse or even the left and arrow right keys on your keyboard to scroll vertically within chart data. You'll need to hold the control key on your keyboard and then click and drag in the price axis of the chart. Note that scrolling vertically will also place the chart into a fixed scale as I previously demonstrated. You can return to auto scaling by clicking the F icon once more. If you scroll back in time on your chart, you can always return to the current bar by clicking the return icon in the top right corner of the chart. You may also want to look at a specific time within your chart date. This can be accomplished quickly with the go to menu. Right clicking on the scroll bar will allow you to access the go to menu. From here, you can select the date and time you'd like to pull into focus. To zoom into a specific area of a chart, click the magnifying glass icon from the chart toolbar. Next, select the data range you'd like to zero at home. To return to the previous view at any time, simply click on the magnifying glass icon with the minus symbol. Lastly, you may want to change bar spacing or bar width when looking at price data. This could be accomplished using the options at the bottom of the chart style menu or by using the hotkeys listed on these options. Remember, the control key is for bar spacing and the Alt key is for bar width. Adjustments can be made using the up and down arrows of your keyboard. Okay, now you have learned about how to scroll zoom and navigate charts. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, share, and click the red subscribe button below. Hit the notification bell to be notified for more videos. See you in the next episode.